For now, uh, let's turn to Action News reporter Alan Sanchez, who is live in Salinas tonight with more. Alan. Yeah, it was uh, definitely an intense uh, morning. Uh, this morning, uh, we dealt with a lot of the wind, not so much the rain, until about around noon is when we saw the combination of an intense rain and wind in the area, knocking down trees in the Santa Cruz area. The rain was steady uh, for most of the afternoon, uh, catching many people off guard, including uh, catching, uh, keeping busy CHP and also uh, PG&E with a lot of street-level flooding debris on the roadway and the power did go around uh, did go down around the about the same time in parts of SoCal closing down some businesses knocking out the power to traffic signals in many intersections a manager of a local gas station was witness to a traffic accident that was caused by slick roads and the power outage it was a big like boom inside so I was looking inside I was trying to see what's going on inside and then another boom happened out here so I started looking out here and that's when the accident Notice there was an accident. I called 911 right away. Does anything work? Did you just pump gas? Nothing at all. Nothing. No gas, no electricity. Can't do nothing. No lights inside. Nothing. Not at all. It's actually real wet. I can't even go outside. My dog's stuck in there. He can't even go. So it's just uh, staying inside, basically, you know? Yeah, as for the uh, traffic accident, there was no injuries to report. We did see some cafes with some customers inside ho with hope that the power would be restored quickly. But uh, according to this PG&E's website, uh, the power is still out uh, in the area and it's affecting over 1,000 customers. And it's expected to be restored in about an hour. And we'll keep that updated you for everyone at 11. Lauren? Okay, great. Thank you so much, Alan. Be safe out there.